Take advantage of Open Rail Concept Station on your next rail project by planning and visualizing that concept quickly and easily. Here as we begin a project using the built-in uh, location tools in Open Rail Concept Station, we create the project defining a project area. Then using geo-coordination services, we are able to query and download data such as imagery and terrain, which you see here. Upon the download of that imagery and that terrain, that data is compiled and creates the area, the project area, and a reality mesh, giving us full context of the existing conditions within our um, project area. Now as we begin laying out our conceptual rail line, we uh, lay out in the horizontal our rail line taking into account design criteria such as railway classification, um, design speed as well as typical section. As we lay that out across our reality mesh you'll notice that the cuts and fills have been calculated and modeled automatically. The layout of the railway is uh, modeled in three dimensions so we can rotate the view up to see that model. In addition to the railway itself, structural elements such as bridges can be incorporated into our rail line very quickly. Those structural elements have uh, interactive capabilities so that we can make modifications. Here you'll see we're adjusting the pier location along our bridge over an existing roadway. Also included are analysis tools allowing us to analyze our conceptual um, railway in relation to other elements. Here we're checking the bridge clearance over the existing roadway and you'll note if we need to make modifications we simply modify the profile grade line of our rail infrastructure and make that modification quickly. Along with bridges, tunnels can be incorporated within our rail lines. Here we're going to place a tunnel along the section of railway through the side of the mountain. And we, you see we can do that quite quickly, quite easily. The modification to the design model happens instantaneously. Modifications to that tunnel are quick. Here we'll just drag back and change the ending location of uh, the tunnel. The tunnel has been modeled in three dimensions. We can rotate the view up and take a look at it. Just as before with the bridge, modifications to specific parameters of that tunnel can be made quickly, such as the shape, the width, the size, and so forth. In addition to those structural elements, a full library of turnouts from around the world are included as well. Here we're placing a turnout as we develop a yard along our um, conceptual model. Rail connections can be made quickly simply by snapping those connections to the turnouts. You'll see that connection was made very quickly. Turnouts can be incorporated as well. Here we'll just fit a turnout quickly into that area. Again, as we continue developing um, this yard area within our conceptual design. In addition to the elements you've seen so far, overhead line electrification infrastructure can be included as well. So here we're going to electrify the yard area. We have included uh, portals along with cantilevers. You can see those now in the model incorporated directly in our yard area. Modifications to those OLE uh, infrastructure can be made directly as we reconnect lines. Here we're going to move a mast along the railway, again along the bridge, just make a relocation of it quickly and easily. Design standards are adhered to throughout this uh, process. Here you'll see that CANT is included within the rail model as we enter and exit the horizontal curve. You can see the transition taking place. The concept can be uh, quantified and cost estimates included very quickly. Here you see the tabulation of uh, estimated quantities along with estimated costs as well so that you can summarize the expenses associated with your conceptual design. In addition to the design parameters and the layout parameters, a full set of visualization and animation tools are included in open rail concept station. Here we'll simply fly through our conceptual rail uh, rail line 
again, ultimately to allow you to fully convey uh, your plan or your concept to a broad audience. So on your next rail project, plan faster, make better decisions using Open Rail Concept Station.